I'm doing another hair video. Y'all see I'm in my bathroom. I might sound a little funny because I am sick. I done caught a cold. This weather's changing because it's fall time. I don't really know. But I usually get sick like every time the weather changes. I think that's normal. I think that everybody gets sick when the weather changes. So, please bear with me. My nose is very stopped up, but y'all see, I'm still trying to get out a video for you guys. So, yeah, I know I might look dead, but it's okay. Right? So, today, I'm going to be doing my hair. I'm not bleaching it. Y'all see how much my hair has grown since the last time I bleached my hair. My hair, I feel like it grows fast. My hair, sh my, the shrinkage is so real. It's like you cannot really tell. But anyway, this is freshly washed hair. It's, it's dry now because I'm about to dye my hair red. Uh, I've dyed my hair red before, semi-permanent, but um, it was just on my regular uh, dark brown hair. So it really didn't show up that well but since I'm doing it on already bleached hair. I'm ready to see how red is going to really get because, you know, when you light up, when you already lighten your hair and then put color on it, it's brighter. But I've always done it, like, with a dark color. And, you know, you never really see. You see, like, a real little red tint, but this is about to be really red. So, I have already read the directions. This is by Color Brilliance. Um, this is a semi-permanent. And it has the number right here. I'll leave that in the description box. But yeah. I'm about to dye my hair red. I just got some regular gloves. I forgot to get some black hair gloves. So I just picked these up from the store. So. But it's going to be fiery red. Like for real. I, oh I'm so nervous. Oh my gosh. What am I doing? Gonna have to really go through this hair and lock this color in. I wish I had some type of shampoo or conditioner that I can put in my hair to help keep the color, but I don't, so I have to just use what I got. Hopefully, you know. It'll still give me the same results. Y'all, I'm about to be a redhead. Like, it kind of looks cute, don't it? But y'all, I really was. I was so over my blonde. I feel like I've had it since February. So, yeah, it was kind of that time to let it go. So now that it's bleached, <clears throat> you know, you might as well try some things. I need to give my blood a rest. So I'm about to just go through this, make sure I'm getting everything. Which is going to be kind of hard to go through.
Right now, I'm just combing through my hair just to get some of the kinks out. Alright, I don't use up the whole thing now. I just squeeze out the rest that I can. And kind of apply it to my hair. I'm going to just still cover up my head just because I want to. I'm just about to still cover up my head. Whether I need heat or not, I don't know. But just because I'm going to cover up my head with a cap. It says, I don't know, it says two different things. You can or you don't have to or you don't need to. But I am just because, I don't, I don't know, I feel like I should. So, I'm going to leave this on for probably, it says, to what, 20 to 40 minutes? I'm probably might do just an hour, honestly. Or, I'll do 45 minutes or 50 minutes. So, so it's been about 50 something minutes now. And... This is pretty much what it's looking like. But I don't know, I might leave it on for a little bit longer without the cap. And let it still get a little bit more red. So it can kind of be like this dark red and not so super, super bright. Because right now, it's a little like a burgundy. And I kind of like this, so. Uh, I think I'm about to leave it on here. For a little bit more without the cap, so I'm gonna leave it on for like um, about 20 minutes. Yeah, 20 minutes, and then I'll be back. Alright, so it's 20 minutes later, y'all. I'm so sick, it's like really killing me. But um, this is still what it's looking like, it's a little darker. Hopefully, it's set pretty good, so I'm about to rinse it out. That's Jack's opening up my bathroom door. But yeah, I'm about to rinse it out. I really don't know what products I'm about to use to actually rinse this out with. I don't really know. But whatever I use, I just end up telling y'all later. So I'm about to rinse this out and we'll see the results soon. Okay. my shirt. I don't care. It's my head shirt. Y'all. So, here is the results. Jet. So, all right. So, I am officially a redhead. So right now, oh, and all I did, all I used uh, to, I just rinsed it out. And then I just did my co-wash since I shampooed already. So I just used the co-wash and my hair. I guess how long I left it on. Uh, the color stuck even without me using a um, color treated uh, shampoo and conditioner or whatever 
So if you all don't have those products, I think that it's okay for you to um, use whatever you have that's in your apartment, I mean that's in your house or whatever product wise but you guys this looks really good you know like I'm just like amazed yes I mean of course it didn't do nothing to my roots I didn't I mean I like the fact that my roots are still dark and you know and I have this new color on top it's pretty cool I'm about to do a deep conditioner I'm about to do my deep conditioner this strengthen and restore treatment mask because I need my hair to be strong so I'm about to do this deep conditioner definitely recommend that brand like I said I left this on for about almost an hour and then with the cap and then I let it sit for like 20 more minutes uh, without a cap so I really do think that that's what helped me get this so, I'm about to do this deep conditioner mask so I can strengthen my hair again because, ooh, y'all, I do low-key have breakage, but I mean, it all comes with color-treated hair, so it's something that you just have to get used to, it's not the end of the world, you know, so I'm just going to be putting in this deep conditioner going underneath my dryer for about 15 20 minutes with this on and then i'll do my leave-in conditioner put my oil in my scalp go through with this comb and comb through make sure that the ends are covered. Y'all let me know what y'all think about this color of me being a redhead. It's crazy. My hair color has never been this red before. But I like it. I don't know. I don't know why, but I really do like red hair. I have two wigs that kind of got like red in it. So it's like, I don't know what it is about me with this red hair that I like so much. I don't really know, but I do like red hair for some reason. I'm just gonna put a little bit more. I'm gonna put a cap on and go under the dryer for 20 minutes. Make sure you get those ends. Put on the plastic cap. Alright, 20 minutes. 